Good evening YouTube. I thought I'd talk to you guys about Jobsworth and uh, a recent experience I've had of a Jobsworth. Um, during the uh, school holidays I uh, normally take my daughter to one of the local uh, school holiday clubs and uh, she's been going for a number of years and we've never had any problems. Um, and what usually happens if it's a week that I've got my daughter I uh, normally book her in on a what we call a long day which is 8 o'clock in the morning till 6 o'clock at night what a twat what a twat what on earth was he doing anyway what was I saying oh yeah so yeah like I was saying so if it's a week that um, I normally have my daughter, I book her in what we call a long, long day, so it's 8am in the morning till 6pm at night. If it's a week that my ex-wife has my daughter, I normally book her in on a short day, because my ex-wife finishes early, so that means she starts holiday club at 9am, and she finishes holiday club at 3pm in the afternoon, because my ex-wife finishes, I think she finishes at half two in the afternoon, and uh, she normally picks her up when she's finished work. Anyway, she's been at Holiday Club for a few years, never had any problems, until this week. Now on Monday, as always, it was a short week, so I dropped my daughter off. About It was about quarter to nine, ten to nine, something like that. Uh, no problems. And I went to work. Tuesday, again, about ten to nine, dropped my daughter off. But this time, the uh, girl in the Holiday Club says to me, I'm sorry, but uh, one of my managers has noticed that uh, yesterday and today you've uh, arrived too early. And unfortunately you're going to have to stay in the holiday club with your daughter. That was a bit naughty of me. Sorry about that. I think I just got a little bit carried away with my vlog. Just goes to show uh, sometimes I make mistakes. But uh, I got away with it on this occasion. Yeah, anyway, so... Yeah, I was early and um, she drew this to my attention and I said, well, I never normally complained about it. She says, oh, but this time my manager said you're too early and unfortunately you're going to have to stop in the holiday club until nine o'clock with your daughter uh, because unfortunately you're too early. So I thought, oh, I've got to say it. Anyway, I did it because I wasn't going to argue. Anyway, today, which is Wednesday, I thought, well, I'd better not go too early again. So I got there for about five to nine. And bugger me. She says to me, you're early again. I says, look, it's only five to. I'm sorry, but you're still early. You're going to have to wait for five minutes. I thought, this is ridiculous. Anyway, I said to her, look, I'm not being funny. It's not your fault. It's obviously your manager's fault. But when I pick my daughter up in the evening, and when my ex-wife picks her up in the afternoon, we are always, always early. I says, I normally pick her up at least half an hour early. And my ex-wife picks her up ten minutes early. And you never complain about that. But for some reason, because we are really, you're complaining. Oh, no, it, don't have a go at me. It, it's not my fault. It's, it's my manager. So, look, I'm not having a go at you, but listen. If, if that's the way things are going to be, then this, this is what I'm going to do in future. So in future, myself and my ex-wife pick my daughter up, bang on the time that we're due to pick them up. So that'll be 3 o'clock in the afternoon on a short week or a short day and 6pm in the evening on a long day. And that's the way it's going to be, unfortunately. And I know that'll piss people off because I know when I've got there, my daughter's been one of the last there and uh, the girls that are doing the later shifts are really pleased because it means that they can go early. But I'm sorry, but this time they're going to have to stop till 6. So, you know, if you're going to start playing that game, I'm going to start playing that game as well. Because it, you know, it cuts both ways. You know, I don't take the mickey. I feel if I've dropped her off early, then it's only right that I should pick up early. Anyway, that's my story, guys. So, um, let me know if you've had any experiences of any jobs with and um, what that experience was, and drop it in the comments below. So, as always, ride safe, and I'll uh, catch you next time.